Welcome back, classmates, to the Blessed Be channel. And guess what? It's lunchtime. Okay, let me show you how you used to come in and say it. Okay. Say it. See what I just said. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Blessed Be channel. And guess what? It's, it's lunchtime. lunchtime. Be on the look for you later than I am. You ready? Okay. Welcome back to the. You got a smile. Welcome back to the Blessed Be channel. And guess what? It's lunchtime. Lunch Can you say it's lunchtime? Okay. Okay. Welcome back to the Blessed Be channel. And it guess. <laughs> Sorry. Welcome back to the Blessed Be channel, and guess what? It's, it's lunchtime. lunchtime. Okay, y'all already know your girl. I am Brittany, which you guys already know that, but we have a special guest because we're doing something totally new today. We're going to do a mukbang, okay? A poor boy mukbang. But before I get into all of what we got going on with this little station, I'm going to introduce my guest. You guys know her as my daughter, okay? My oldest daughter. But some guys know me as the Realest Bray TV. So make sure you guys also go and subscribe to her channel. But I don't know if I should introduce her channel. Yes. Because we link we, in bio. We in a competition. So I'm trying to beat you. I'm trying to get more subscribers no, than you. It's okay, so just scratch that, you guys. Don't subscribe. Don't go do any to of that. The Realest Bray. <laughs> Make sure we're, we're in the bed that I'm gonna get more subscribers than her and I'm slowly catching up. So I'm probably gonna edit that part out, okay? No. Moving on. We're doing po' boys, and I have the shrimp po' boy. And then I got some jalapeno poppers and some fries. Got to have me some ketchup. Alright, guys, so I got a sausage for It's not boy. guys, it's classmates here. <sighs> anyway. Classmates, I got a sausage po' boy, some fries, and some mozzarella sticks with a Sprite. And I got Dr. Pepper. Oh, that's what they just like, ketchup? No, this is mozzarella sauce. Girl, open it up right there. I want me a, I'm going to steal the mozzarella stick. We're going we gonna to be trading off. She want a pepper, I want a mozzarella stick. But I like a lot of ketchup, y'all, and I like a lot, a lot, a lot of mustard. I made sure I told them extra, extra, um, well, we're getting it from Pobo Express. I'm not sure if Popo Express is, um, I wonder if it's a Louisiana thing or if it's all over. No idea. It might just be a Louisiana thing. I don't know. All right. So, first bite. <sighs> Mushroom's falling. Mmm. Is this your first time eating from there? I eat from there one time. I'm gonna need to make sure you keep a lot of napkins because you don't know how to eat good. Come on. Wipe your mouth clean. So, I also got a hot sausage, so it's hot. Mmm. Spicy. Mmm. We both need napkins. Mmm. Good. I like it. Me too. Okay. So, to get the nice start, to get it started, we're going to be discussing hot topics. Braylon didn't want to discuss the hot topics, but I, I got to have a, a nice hot topic. I got to go in my mama mode and just, and just teach us some stuff. So, with this channel being all things relationships, whether, whether it's personal, business, friendships, relationships. So tonight we're gonna be discussing a hot topic. My our coworkers, <laughs> our coworkers, Ken and Deara. So as of recently, Ken has been caught cheating on Deara, and she loved their channel. She subscribed to the channel. Me and her have difference of opinions as far as what went down and. And all that good stuff. Because they're like all the kids' sensation. So a lot of kids look up to them. So I have my opinion about it. She don't agree. So that's just like when the video first happened. And I show her the video because she follows these people. 
And what you said when you seen the video? I didn't believe that was them. Because him. Him because I don't believe anything off the internet. But when more things and T came more out, now I'm starting to believe that he actually did cheat. So at first I did disagree, but now I agree. But at first it was like, no, that's not him. And whoop de woody boom. And I'm trying to explain to her. Because when she gets older, I don't want her to make the same mistakes I made. I don't want her to be that craziest fool that I was. And green as all get out. I don't want her to be that way. Oh, but now she believes it. Even even though got even though classmate, she had already seen the video. His brother had already came out and said it was his brother. She still didn't believe it. What else would you have needed to believe it? What else would you have needed other than a video of your sensation Ken and his own tw twin brother saying that it was him? What else did you need? I needed more proof from both of them. Like what kind of proof? Like I needed to see if he was going to tell the truth or lie about it and see like more stuff, like more things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, you see that he came out a lot about it. Mm -hmm. He lied, so that's why I do agree. That's all I pretty much needed the responses to see what it was that night, like if he was even there. Like, but I do believe that was his Tesla and everything, so yeah. I mean, you can clearly look at the video and tell he was there. I'm just making sure what if. What if he would have been at home with Diarra, then that would have been somebody else. No, nobody look like him that much, brother. I don't like how they handled the situation with the lying. Um, he came out and said that he had met the girl at the club and all of that good stuff when her husband came out and said something totally different. So for me, I would have respected them more if he would have told the truth. And he had been caught cheating before. And like I raised her, when you when you stand with the man and you're giving him everything and y'all shacking up and all that good stuff. I mean, yeah, he proposed to her, but at the end of the day, I feel like had she wouldn't have you know, pretty much became a living girlfriend, all that stuff. Maybe things would be different. Maybe he'll have a little, a little bit more respect for her. But that's a prime example where I tell you, don't be shacking up, giving a man your everything and all that stuff. Because it's like, why well, buy the cow? You get the milk for free. Remember when you was watching it before a few years ago? And I told you then, I didn't like them living together. Remember? Mm -hmm. Remember? I do. That was my problem with her watching them dinner. But they was engaged. It don't matter they're not married. And that sent the wrong message because I didn't want her watching that. Because it probably sends her the wrong, the wrong message to her. And then the other young people that follow them. You know, like living boyfriend, girlfriend. That's not how it's supposed to be. Probably be married for you stay together. So, this last mistake he done made. It's no wrath for me. Ken gets an F and an unsubscribe in this household. An unsubscribe. You have to take accountability. You have to be honest. And I don't want my baby looking up to some people like that. So I personally don't think they're going to leave him. It's all about the money. If I was there, I would like. I will still be friends, but we have to move in different houses so we can still make the money together because they clearly like both seeing both of them. But I will also make my own separate channel and stuff. But yeah, he also, but I also would still make the money and still go with it. But we wouldn't be like, we wouldn't be a couple. We will just be friends and so we could still make the money and do stuff together. Cause that's what people like to see. That's what I do if I was the era. So you're like seeing it even though you know it's fake. 
I mean, no, you know, they're acting and pretending. You'll be okay still seeing it. Hmm. You'll still be as excited if they come out. So we're not together no more. And then they just play, play happy. No. They is happy. They are happy. They're, they're not happy. happy. How? I want you to learn now. How they're not happy, Mom? And then some of men have to step out, Braylon. He's not happy. He's not happy. Exactly. Like that? That's why they're friends and they just only doing it for YouTube. They still friends for YouTube, but they're not dating their friends. They're just like the friends you have now. Exactly. If we were like, growing up on YouTube, then yes, I would still do my YouTube channel with them. Even if one of them portrayed you really bad. I still be like, okay, well, we need to get What if they this. stole something from you? I was like, okay, we need to get over this. We just need to make some money. They're gonna have to pay me back and get my stuff back. Some of y'all, some of y'all might be like, oh, why is she discussing that with a twelve-year-old? Cause this ain't nothing new. I discuss this with her on and on and off the camera. I'm giving her lessons that this twelve-year-old gonna eventually be a woman, and I don't want her to be a dumb one. So we gonna dip that in the bud ASAP. Okay? Mm. These scotches are okay. Who's gonna change the subject? <laughs> no. <laughs> How you like your food, Mom? Don't be doing that fake voice over here. Don't, don't do that. Because you don't even sound like that in real life. Don't do that. Don't do no fake voice here. No YouTube voice. <laughs> don't do that. I don't know who you think you will. <laughs> we black. How do you like <laughs> Don't do that. Talk How regular. You, How you like your food? How your food taste, mama? You be like, how you like your food, mom? Oh, uh, like, hey, mama, how your food taste? Yeah. She ain't that nice. Mmm, that food good. What would you rate it one to ten? Mmm, <clears throat> this was a purple. I mean, it's good. I can't, it's nothing missing. I guess I'm not complaining about it. I guess a ten. A ten? You know what? They ain't put my tomatoes on here. Oh, wait. Ooh. This is here. Uh, this is here. <laughs> but you know what? Ain't no pickles on here. Remain silent. Maybe a bit. What? Well, okay, what's the point of that, Braylon? So they can see the stretch. Mm -hmm. And them dry. They, not, they look like that, but they dry. The cheese is dry. <laughs> <laughs> if it had pickles, I'll give it a nine, but if it had pickles, it'd be better. So, I rate my food. The fries is pretty good. I'm gonna give them a. I'm gonna give the fries a seven. The mozzarella sticks are really good. Just a little, little, little dry. What else you want to talk about? Want to talk about school? What? Okay. What else was one of your topics? We're gonna talk about school too. You ever talk to you? Well, I know you punish. You still have your same old friends? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to talk to them? Here's our punish. Okay. So, we done with the air and can. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna catch you watching. Look. Look what? <laughs> they come out with the video saying. Oh, we just friends, but we still would be doing YouTube because we still make money. You're not going to come out with that, Brandon? I'm saying, where do they do that? Yeah, that's different. They admit everything and all of this. It's not going to happen, though. Next subject. Don't boy. Okay. I better not catch you. Next subject. It's going to be that NBA young boy. Okay. You that's your favorite rapper? That's one of them. I wanna know why you like the the characters you like. What you mean? Right. Like, you know what? I, mean? I got that confused. I thought that was the rest of this. <laughs> I was looking in there until I started tasting it. That was crazy. Like, why do you why did you like him being young boy? Do you think he's your favorite rapper? No, uh, he's not my favorite. 
Who your favorite rapper? You? Ron Wave. Ron Wave is not a rapper. He's a singer. <laughs> it's a rapper, guys. Real Ron Wave fame. He's a rapper and um singer. He's not a rap. He's a rapper and a singer. <laughs> <laughs> what does he rap? A lot. What song he rap? I hear him sing. What, what part of the song he rap? A lot. She a rapper. Um. Yeah. I never fail. The reason I never fail, but they trip. Never mind. No. <laughs> never, never mind. Don't worry about it. But just this day, oh, I'm done. Feel okay. All right. Stay. We done. Okay. We are done. Okay. But you like him being young boy. Mm. But you know you have to separate the music from the artist, right? Mm-hmm. So you like his music? Do you like him as a person? Like, as far as what you, because you don't know him personally. Yeah. But, like, do you like the persona of him? Like, what do you mean? Like, no, that kind of beats me. I don't know what that would mean. Like, just like, I love Beyonce. But, knowing about her personal life, of what I do know, she seems like she's. People respect her. She's not the queen for nothing. They respect her. Check your body. She's like a, she made a, she, she's like an honest woman, you know. She she got married first. She had kids first. I mean, she got she got married first. Then she had kids. She keeps her relationships private. She just cares herself well. You don't know much about her. So she seems like a decent human being. Um. I mean, a young boy don't seem like a decent human being. Why I not? just like his music. Why do you feel like he's not a decent human being? Because he just, he talks about, he don't talk about, he just. We're not talking about his rapping. I know. Human being, he have like a lot of baby moms, which is not really good. But, but yeah, other than that, and then he be in gangs and stuff, but I don't even know that's true. People just say that for good content and music, so you don't even know real true stuff, but I do know that he has a lot of baby mamas. So would you date a man that has five baby mamas? If they might understand. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't understand. <laughs> Wasn't you about to say playing with me? <laughs> Wipe your mouth. And what was you about to say playing with him? The thing was it, right? No, ma'am. And this one, guys. Classmates. But would you date a guy with five baby mama? No, ma'am. Four baby mama? No, ma'am. <laughs> so what you think wrong with the girls that's dating him then? Well, they done dated him and, and he done had four, five baby mama. That's on them. That's on them. I feel like they do what they want to do. But not you. No, I'm good. So when you get grown and you're not here with me, you're going to do what you want to do too. <laughs> you smile like you guys. You thinking about what you're going to do already. You sneaking. <laughs> hmm? Ma'am? Good. Don't be sneaky. Boy. Okay? No. Don't be sneaky. I feel like something wrong with those girls. So, well, you have to date a man with, with so many baby mamas like that. For self esteem issue, it's too many baby mamas got to deal with each other and all of that. And then you don't hear good stuff about him as a father, so that's not good either. But really, I don't even know really much about him. I don't know if they got a lot of baby mamas. He has really good music. He looks like he on drugs too half the time. You don't think he on drugs? No? I don't smoke. He on the smoke? What you think he's smoking? Um... 
Cigarettes. <laughs> oh, cigarettes. Okay, girl. Cigarettes. She thinks he's smoking cigarettes. I will say this, though. Like I said before, that, that money, Yaya, that he done got pregnant. This woman's daddy is almost a billionaire. And it's unfortunate that you can't go to the store and say, hey, what well, all is common sense on? I need to get a pound of that. It's unfortunate that you can't, you cannot go to the store and you cannot buy you some common sense. Because that right there, I never understand it. That's crazy. That's too many, that's too many kids. Crazy. A lot of kids. That reminds me of that time when, when I had got pregnant with Brayley. And then I had, I forgot where I had came. I had just went out somewhere. I think I had lunch with a friend or something. And mama said that she had talked to you about how kids were made. Huh? And I told her, I was like, why did you tell her that? You asked her how was kids made? I don't really know. What made her tell you how kids were made? Maybe I was like. Maybe we were talking about Brayley and the baby. Got, how I got pregnant? No, it was like, I was like, um, when is Brayley going to come? I was just asking questions. I was like nine or eight. So I'm like, nine. where's, where's, um, when is Brayley going to come? She's going to come from heaven. She's going to come from the sky. So I was just <laughs> asking questions. And then my mom just told me. She just told you? Wow. What she told you? My business. <laughs> don't do that. What you mean don't do that? How did she <laughs> tell your kids were made? I don't know. I don't remember. You want me to tell you? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I'm just saying you forgot? <laughs> the boot camp you went to, they taught you? <laughs> I, I didn't know, but I don't remember what my mom told me. Okay. Well, how are kids made? I have no idea, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Classmates? Classmates. Oh, you don't know how kids are made? Or you don't want to say how kids are made? I don't need to know anything. <laughs> how kids are made? What? And why they're made. I know why they're made so they can have more people in the world and more generations. But, okay. I just want you to be careful. I'm so full. I'm getting full too. I want you to be a nice young lady. I want you to go out into the world and, and explore all your dreams. I just want you to be safe. I have a video I want you to watch too. I forgot the lady's name, but she have our last name. Coincidentally, she have our last name. And she talked about how she contracted HIV from one of her partners at the age of, um, she was 18 or 19. 18 or 19 years old. And that's why it's very important that you be safe because I just don't want, I don't want you to go out in this world and be naive and believe everything that you hear. Um, and then I not believe. That's why I don't believe in it. Okay, but you saw that. That wasn't word of mouth. That, did, that man did that to that girl. You saw the video. And that's my thing. I don't want you to ever think that even, even with a guy... Even even if you hear that's just like just like around the neighborhood, if you hear if you hear a man like men, likes men, you got to take heed to that. You can't just you know talk to the guy and then not have it in the back of your mind that people say this man like men. What do you mean? You know, like if somebody tell you they heard something about a guy and he likes guys, you can't just say oh, I don't believe everything I hear. Oh well, right? I don't. Okay, but you still have to. That's like, somebody, that's like my mom telling me, you pregnant again. And I'm going to be like, oh, my mama pregnant? But the thing is, I'm your mother. You can come ask me. But if you know, but if you dating a man and somebody said that man, that man likes men, you can go ask him too. But you think he's going to tell you the truth? Yes, because that's my partner. And if he don't, then I'm leaving. Peace out. How do you know if he's not going to tell you the truth, though? And then he's not telling the truth. Then How do you know? Because I can know if you like boys or girls. Oh, you think you can tell the difference? <laughs> oh, we, honey. I got a, I got, I got a, <laughs> wait, 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 I got some that. molding to do, honey. Wait, what do you mean by that? You cannot, you cannot all the time tell. And you could tell. Not really. Okay. No, no, they can't. I wish we had your phone. We can go through it. I, I will, we'll pick, we'll pick. 
Gail straight. Huh? Gail straight. I don't think you know the difference like that. I don't think you know the difference like that. I know. I know the difference. If you say so. But my thing is oh, straight. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but I want. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> my next mistake I talked to my hair. I don't know. But in the discussion class, thank you guys for watching this video. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, nothing. Okay, so my thing is, I just want you to be safe. I have a video that I want you to watch. But you know, ultimately, what NBA young boy needed? He needed a daddy. I don't know if he have a dad. He, he have a dad. God. He didn't only need God. He needed this too. He needed what? What is that? You know what that is? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Do you know what that is? Do you know what that is? Braylon, where are you going? Where are you going? Make sure you guys subscribe to the Rizzo's Red TV. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Braylay, come sit down. I know you was doing it in a store. What are you? Come on, sit down. Let's talk about it. Come on, when you went to camp, y'all talked about this, huh? <laughs> Ain't y'all talk about that when you went to camp last year? Y'all talked about all of this. HIV, AIDS, unplanned pregnancies. Let's talk about it. Nah. You don't want to talk about it? No. Why not? Because I don't want to. <laughs> you mad at me? Come on, you want to talk about the next video? No, I don't want to talk about no video. Think about the young girls that's watching. They want to know about it. And I think mama. <laughs> What if they don't have a mom or a dad? Well, who they gonna ask? Somebody off YouTube, but not this family. <laughs> it was a prank. What prank was this? It was a prank! I won! <laughs> I feel like NBA Young Boy was the perfect thing to mention since he got all them kids. So, yeah, I just had to slide it on in there and I did, I did good. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha, I got, got her. What kind of prank was this? Kind of I don't know how to name it, but I know it was a prank. I wanted to be funny. Um, Actually, Daddy, I talked to him about it earlier. I said I got a prank, good prank for Braylon. She might walk off, and you did exactly what I said you were going to do. Walk <laughs> off. You guys, Jesus. You guys, some bangers <laughs> coming through. If you guys, guys want to see some pranks, sorry. My mom, make sure you guys go in my comment section. I will. I got it. I got it on lock. There will be pranked. And I will catch her um, bald head when she take the braids off. So, <laughs> guys, stay tuned. I'll keep my wig on, honey. Okay? You gonna see. You gonna see. What's the, I cut my hair. Of course, I've cut all my hair off. I cut all of it off. But that's not the point. The point is, we're done eating. The food was amazing. This is our first mukbang. I hope it was not too bad. Um, I feel like I taught you a lesson, but not too much of a lesson. The prank was awesome, though. The prank no, was awesome. I'm, trying, I'm still trying to figure out what the prank was. Because this prank was... Make my daughter crazy. uncomfortable prank. <laughs> I, think that, I think that's a good name for it. I made you uncomfortable. Ain't this how I was saying? You think you know everything. I'm sure they got a prank like that. I'm just saying, I create the stuff. I can't keep doing... I'm making you uncomfortable. So I made her uncomfortable just like I wanted to. So guess what? Team Blessed Be. Okay, Team Blessed Be. All right, classmates. Don't forget to get this video. Don't forget to give... Stop. <laughs> Don't forget... Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Also, you can also email me or comment down below what other mukbangs you would like to see us do. Let me know how I did with that prank, you guys. Okay? I just, for that prank, I know how she is. And I just knew it was going to just get her to walk off. I just knew Team that's what it was going to be. Team the realest break TV, you guys. No. Like Team Blessed Be, we got it. Okay? That prank was awesome. It worked. She was mad, y'all. She was, was mad. mad. But anyway, we ain't... We, 
We ain't about to get... Then your mic... She's so mad her mic ain't even in. Her mic ain't even in. <laughs> but anyway, classmates, until next time, like, comment, <laughs> and subscribe to The Realest Break. And make sure y'all unsubscribe to Brittany. What? Whatever. <laughs> until next time, you guys. Class is dismissed. Dismissed. <laughs> <Praise> <laughs>